How are we all doing? Everybody okay? Yes! This is fun. There's good things happening. The 2022 CJF Jackman Award for Excellence in Journalism Small Media Presentation goes to news organizations that embody exemplary journalism and have a profound positive impact on the communities they serve. Named after Eric Jackman, the founder of the CJF, a business leader, an award-winning clinical psychologist, he, along with the founding directors, developed the criteria for this award, which reflects his passion and deep commitment to the CJF's mission and recognizes his vision, guidance, and continued contribution to strengthening journalism. And the nominees for this award are Indigenous for exposing the government lawyers had told the BC government that the controversial practice of birth alerts was illegal and unconstitutional months before the government stopped that program. Rocky Mountain Outlook for Buried in the Aftermath, a four-part series on how the Association of Canadian Mountain Guides handles avalanche fatalities on guided trips in the Canadian Rockies. The Saskatoon Star Phoenix for Trapped, a seven-part series that reveals how government systems are woefully unprepared to help people struggling with substance use. The Narwhal for Amber Bracken's first-person photo essay that connected her arrest while covering an Indigenous anti-pipeline protest with broader police violations of the rights of journalists. And the TIE for its investigation into the Alberta government's covert efforts to undo decades-old regulations to open up the Rockies' sensitive eastern slopes to open-pit coal mining. All amazing work. This year's honoree is an organization that boasts a courageous roster of storytellers dedicated to covering the news in a way that allows for stories to be heard, understood, and respected. They are journalists who tell the stories of the British Columbia communities in a manner that is nothing short of brave. Congratulations to the 2022 recipient of the CJF Jackman Award for Excellence in Journalism, Small Media Presentation, Indigenous. Accepting the award this evening, please welcome Kelsey Kalana. Thank you all so much. I wanted to say that Kelsey Kalana couldn't be here tonight. Um, and so we are here. My name is Eden Feinde. And I'm Tessa Vikander. These stories weren't written by uh, me, but Tessa co-wrote one of them. And Anna McKenzie, Brielle Morgan, <laughs> and Bailey uh, Morell um, wrote them. So congratulations to those three writers for Indigenous, amazing storytellers. Thank you. Indigenous people have been here forever. We have been your neighbors for hundreds of years. Many of you don't know us and don't know anything about us. Um, I encourage you all to start reading Indigenous and all Indigenous storytellers who are speaking their truths. Um, we know things that you don't know and we really want to share them with you. Uh, and that's what we endeavor to do at Indigenous. So thank you so much for paying attention to us this year. We're really grateful. As many of you know, we at Indigenous have a mixed team. So we have Indigenous reporters and editors and non-Indigenous reporters and editors. I am a settler and I'm non-Indigenous. And what I've learned from working at Indigenous is that simply hiring Indigenous journalists is not enough. We need to put power and money in the hands of Indigenous people to create media and tell their stories. So whatever way you can, whatever, thing, whatever you can do to help that happen, there's a lot of people in this room who have access to resources and power. Please, please, please make that your goal. Thank you. Thank you. 